it since 1988. And while only 1,500 people call this city home, there are 7,000 students that come from the surrounding area that come here to go to school. There are two main entrances. There is the Dutch entrance, which is closest to me here, and there is the Portuguese entrance, which is the older entrance, which is in, um, further over there. Um, and both of them only allow tuk-tuks and smaller vehicles inside, so big buses have to stay outside of the main old city walls. Once you come in, you can wander around. There are boutiques, there are shops, cafes, ice cream parlors, and of course, the very famous clock tower and lighthouse. So if you're in Gaul and it's really hot, which is pretty much always is, you have to come here to Isle of Gelado. It apparently has the best ice cream in Gaul and it's sure to cool you down. So it says all their ice cream is homemade and I just tasted it. Guys, it is so delicious. It's amazing. Melt in the mouth. I got strawberry and zesty orange with cardamom. Um, the only thing is it is so hot here in Gaul that if you don't eat it straight away, it's going to melt all over you. So the trick is go to Isle of Gelato here in Gaul, get an ice cream and eat it in like 20 seconds. This is my room here at the Cinema Gatrans Hotel. We got this really nice day bed, massive double bed, beautiful view. Down onto the swim pool, the garden, and the beach. Best part of all is there is a private balcony just for me. This is the view. And if you go back into the room, open the door, have your gorgeous bedroom. 